how you thought everything went today? Uh, I felt everything went good. PR on some of my events. Uh, I think I could have did a little bit better than what I did. What do you think you could have done better? Uh, you know, just running routes and catching the ball a little bit better than I would is there anything in particular you wanted to improve on from the uh, combine? Uh, just route running. You know, I put on a uh, four more pounds since the combine, so just really wanted to see how it would work. My body would work. You on, how much weight did you put on since? Uh, four pounds. Four Came in at 196, then uh, put on four pounds until now. Okay. Okay. You surprised you jumped even better? Uh, I really was. I wasn't uh, planning on jumping. I talked to Rick. Me and him talking, and it was like a last, a last decision jump. How, how much fun was it to uh, get to play back with, with out here with the Rick and? Justin, and, or excuse me, Tyler, and you know all the guys get back um, together one last it was, time. It was really exciting, you know. We're all uh, silly guys, so we all hang out and joke around. Nothing was really too serious, so you know everybody got along with everybody. What were kind of your expectations and goals coming into today? Uh, you know, to get in the 200 pound range, finally see that, and just definitely come out here and compete. What was Coach Tomlin saying to you out there? Did you, anything in particular you wanted to see? Uh, you know, just uh, he told me. He didn't need to move uh, from the sideline and everything. He said just uh, focus a little bit more than what I have. Here. Were you getting any kind of any kind of feedback from any of the other coaches or GMs or scouts? Uh, yeah, just uh, coming out of my breaks and everything, just trying to make it better. You did run the 40. You were happy, satisfied with your time at the combine, you took it? Or? Yeah. How did you feel just in general about how you did tonight? I felt pretty good. I knew I could have did better than what I wanted to. Uh, but at the end of the day, I felt like I did pretty good. Do you have a good feel for your draft stock right now? I know it's out of your hands, you know, but do you kind of think yeah. this is where I might go? Or? Yeah, I, I feel like I know uh, it's up to the coaches that, you know, anything can happen, so it's just how it's drafted to see what goes. What would it mean to you to get in the front? I mean, I've heard a lot of talk first round or second round. What would it mean to you to get taken in that first round? Uh, you know, it'll, it'll be a, a weight off my shoulders, you know, first round, you know, uh, for the best players and everything, so it'll be a dream come true. Is this Justin Cook is going through this? Have you ever done anything like this? Is this like getting ready for a big game? Is it, is it like getting being recruited to college? Does this compare to anything else? Yeah, uh, no, nah, it's just a big, the biggest job in the good of life. So that's how you got to treat it. So you, do you feel a lot of performance anxiety when you? Yeah, and um, it. yeah, you know, I always like I always get nervous for a game or something like that. Same way here, and I think that brings the best out of it. Yeah, several people from this offense who could get drafted. Does it make you look back at last season and kind of wonder, geez, how did we end up five and seven? Definitely, <laughs> uh, I always talk about that with the guys, and we always laugh about it. Well, yeah, you know, it's something I wish we could have back. But I know we could have won so much more games and some goals. Just you know, I was talking to your mom, and she's well excited obviously. Yeah. What's going on with you? But as part of this, and you're not just doing this for yourself. I mean, you have a chance with a pro contract to better your family. Is that does that kind of add to the to the maybe to the pressure and to the nervousness that it's more expected? Uh, nah, uh, it doesn't. One of my idea, I'm basically just thinking about me and my son. You know, uh, he comes first for everybody else. So that's all. Uh, How much contact has there been, if any, with you, with you and Barrel and Dave Rick? I mean, you're all. Most we'll of your former teammates are here, and you're all going through the same thing. I mean, uh, we definitely talk about it all the time. We, we were training in different places. I know Rick and uh, Cordero were training at the same place, so I always try to make contact with them as much as I could. And uh, definitely, uh, when we got here, we started hanging out. Me and Cindy's had dinner together last night, just talking over everything that's going on. Where have you been training? Uh, IMG Academy. Florida. Yeah, very good. What would it be like to get drafted by the Cowboys and have Coach Dewey? <laughs> you know, it would be cool, you know, I have the three years, so I know how he coaches and everything, so I'm probably used to it.